Yes, thank you very much, Armand. I'm very glad to, to see you on this uh, Sunday's evening. Uh, it's uh, 9 o'clock uh, London time. So, uh, and we're starting this for with our uh, English webinar for, for the new people about the, the Skyway technology. And uh, I would like to thank everybody who's participating. We are 19 people at the moment, so I hope there will be more guests. Uh, first of all, uh, I would like to tell a little uh, small story that I had this weekend. Uh, actually, uh, one of my friends is uh, uh, visiting my at the mo moment, and uh, he, she came from uh, a town from the Russian Federation. Uh, it's called uh, Nizhny Novgorod, yeah, which is uh, quite far away, about uh, 2,500 uh, kilometers from uh, Oslo. So, uh, and uh, when I was calculating. Uh, the time uh, requested for the trip. So actually, it took uh, it took 18 hours to get from uh, Nizhny Novgorod to 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 Fredrikstad. So uh, and it was the combination of uh, train, uh, plane, and uh, and the car. But uh, what is the what was like a an enormous. Uh, Disadvantage of the plane uh, that I get to know that it was uh, half empty. You know, it was Airbus A320, and uh, <laughs> when she told me that it was about 20 people in the plane, and that is 150 persons cap capacity, and flying two times a day, it uh, uh, it's actually it's awful because such plane uh, living uh, uh, in the airspace uh, about 20 tons of exhaust uh, and uh, for this two two thousand kilometers from Moscow to Oslo. So this is how the the ways of how the humanity is uh, taken care about uh, taken care about the nature. So uh, and today you will reveal you will find out how it is possible to keep our planet clean and how it is possible to make our planet more safe here. So uh, I would first of all would like to say about the inventor, of course, the inventor, Mr. Mr. Eduard Natalich Unitsky, and the author and the general designer of Unitsky String Technologies, also uh, as a project manager of two projects in the United Nations, and a member of the Cosmonautics Federation of the United Soviet Socialistic Republic of the USSR, and uh, he, this guy has an, uh, patented over 140 uh, inventions, as well as he's written over 18 monographs and uh, more than scientific work during his life. And so uh, this is a, I would like to name him as a genius of the 21st century. Yeah, one of the genius, of course. So. Uh, at, at the moment, he's the general director of uh, and designer of Skyway Technologies. Uh, of course, during his life, he had a lot of awards and achievements, and uh, like two gold medals uh, of the All Russia Exhibition Center, and the Golden Chariot Illumination Project of the Year of Transport Industry, and uh, the three gold medals in Russian Mark of Quality, and the, the honor a little uh, title of uh, Knight of Arts in Scientific. So uh, this is a very, very interesting and very person with the good uh, life attitude and the, the best uh, knowledge in the te technician industry at the moment. So today we'll have a look at the topics, yeah, mm, like Unitsky and Skyway, innovations in the world of technologies, and uh, Unitsky technology, how is Unitsky technology can save the planet? So talking about it, uh, Skyway technology, what is it? Yes, uh, what, uh, how we see it and actually what is it? So the Skyway is an uh, overground high performance transport technology that has no analogs in the world. And uh, this is the speed, safety, accessibility and uh, environmental friend lines uh, um, type of transport that has uh, never been invented before. So we are like the pioneers of uh, this uh, evolution 
So uh, the Skyway is a stable basis for information, energy, and the transport networks uh, of the new generation. You know, like we, the people of the third generation of the 21st century. So, uh, and of course, all of these elements uh, has been uh, tested. And where it's tested, it's uh, by the computer diagrams, and uh, we are testing it, uh, and we're gonna, and we're gonna um, certificate them in the our Ecotechno Park that is located in the in the Belarusia under the Minsk in the town called Marina Gorka. So the Mount of Maria. Yes. Uh, uh, talking about the advantages of uh, Skyway technologies, of course, it is uh, one, one of the first is the speed, because uh, the speed of uh, Skyway unibuses and unicars can vary, vary from 150 up to 500 kilometers per hour. It depends what type of transport it is. So, and we have uh, like four types of transport, and uh, one is the uh, uh, one one more that is uh, that is kind of uh, not secret one, but a smaller and uh, personal unibus. Yeah, I can say I would say that is it is like this. So uh, the for for this technology, the Skyway technology, and for the for this such high speeds, of course uh, the main uh, factor of of it is aerodynamics. Why is aerodynamics? Because that, that unibus is located uh, on the second level, over the ground, yeah, on the string rail, on the string rail, under the strength, strengthened uh, ways, and uh, the drag of its end of it uh, is much more or less than, for example, the the Bugatti car, yeah, and uh, it's, uh, so this is the the drag of its end is like the most strong advantage as well of it. So, uh, of course, uh, for to build the Skyway, it is much more cheaper than the usual railroad. Yeah, I'm talking about if you put the ground, put it on the ground, we damage the earth because the underwater, uh, under, uh, underground waters, uh, we're pushing them down and uh, it costs a lot of money. A lot of money to put such ways, yeah, and uh, uh, we are taking care about the uh, about the soil uh, on our planet. Uh, this is so the this is uh, this is one of the ecological aspects, of course. So the the construction costs uh, uh, is uh, about could be about maybe three five million. Uh, of dollars per one kilometer, comparing to hundreds, tens of hundreds of millions uh, to the usual railroad, like uh, other our competitors, I would say, yeah, competitors of the previous uh, previous economical structure. <laughs> so, uh, of course, the high uh, high profitability of the Skyway is uh, as well one of the of the biggest advantages. Yeah, like. Uh, uh, financial expenses on construction and running are less by five, seven times and more in comparison with other types of uh, street transport. So uh, as well, low haulage costs and uh, short-term return on investment of the project within three, five years is uh, uh, as well one of the advantages of it. Uh, talking about, for example, the um, uh, ecological aspects as well. So uh, we we are using renewable energy, uh, renewable energy. So uh, as uh, uh, as well as uh, the, uh, Mark uh, Rain Kurzweil, yeah, the, the Kurzweil, uh, the technical director of Google, said uh, that. Uh, uh, the world is slowly but moving every day to the new types of energy, and this energy is renewable energy. So, uh, the century of uh, oil and gas industry is uh, going to finish soon. Yeah, and there was a good, <coughs> good example of it why the Stone Age uh, uh, was 
finished, uh, how has it ended, uh, and the Stone Age has ended because not of the because there was no not more any stones, but because the the humanity humanity they discovered uh, um, copper. Yeah, so the it came uh, copper age. Yeah, then the silver age, steel age, uh, and uh, and and so on and so on. So it's a technological structures. Uh, the 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 world is changing. Yeah, at least every fifty seventy years. So, uh, and here we can see, and uh, for example, such a such interesting thing like um, innovations, innovations uh, through the world uh, uh, technology, as uh, it's of course from the old times. Yeah, but uh, for example, if we take the 20th century, what have been done on the end or the end of 20th century, uh, what what have been done? So it was. Uh, in uh, 1980, it was uh, the Graham Bell who invented the telephone. Yeah. So uh, if you take the phone industry, we have now. Uh, so the first Motorola came out in 1973. Uh, um, yeah, by Craig Cooper. Yes, and uh, this magnificent, I would like to say magnificent. Yeah, smartphone, the uh, iPhone. Uh, 6s uh, uh, with the of course with the fingerprint already yeah with the uh, uh, wireless charger and uh, this is how the technology in on the in this type of industry has uh, has uh, in, uh, has been uh, has been going on and uh, de developing yeah so if we take the transport industry and the innovations in the transport industry during the 20th century so uh, uh, from the end of the 80th century, the Carl Benz was uh, uh, was presented his uh, three wheels, uh, three wheels uh, motor motor vehicle in the 1883. Only yeah. So uh, and uh, the first motorcycle came out in the next year. So uh, of course uh, taking the aircrafts in the industry of uh, Talking about aircraft in the industry of the transportation, yeah, and uh, uh, the first airship Zeppelin came uh, in the 1900. So uh, it was, of course, the huge step of the humanity uh, by the by the taking uh, taking um, new destinations in the transport industry. Uh, diesel engine. Diesel engine in uh, in the beginning of uh, uh, of the 20th century made uh, evolution and and the revolution in the whole industry because after when the diesel engine came out came uh, the car the Henry Ford made the whole industry with the cars from the start in 1930 yeah now we have the in the on the planet the amount of produced the cars by by the big factories and uh, by this industry is equivalent to the amount of people uh, living on the planet. So uh, uh, the taking talking about, coming back again to the aircrafts. Yeah. So the first uh, plane by brother Ryan. Uh, it has has been made, has been made in 1939. Only yeah. And could you imagine? Less than uh, 30 years, yeah, with m maybe 31 years. Yeah, 1969 uh, came the company Boeing came with the first uh, passenger liner. Yeah, and it took 30 years from one uh, from from this uh, yeah, wooden wooden wings uh, to the aircraft. Uh, that that can have, has have good capability and the transatlantic make, making the transatlantic flights. So uh, the trans talking about again the transportations and the the, the uh, that we have bicycles. Yeah, uh, I think everybody knows and or at least seen that is much more much popular on the tourists. Uh, that is uh, for for tourists working. I'm talking about the Segway, the two wheels, sec the two wheels bicycle with the handle like this. Yeah, that is very comfortable. You just slide yourself forward or back and left and right. So you are driving it, 
and it's very and it's make it's made the whole industry again yeah for for this type of transport so in the 2004 uh, the case came uh, the maglev train yeah on the magne uh, magnetic field so uh, and uh, one of the latest inventions uh, by Stefan Klein and his friend it's actually the flying car it was <coughs> what we have seen a lot of uh, a lot of uh, excuse me in the movies like the fifth element where was uh, the, the flying cars yeah okay guys i would like to tell you it's already happening these guys made this fantastic car in uh, to in from in the last year yeah it's driving up to 150 kilometers per hour and uh, it is actually really really nice and uh, uh, i couldn't believe it i couldn't believe it yeah and uh, but it's happening now so uh, the technology do you want or you want don't want the technology is moving forward the innovations uh, they are happening every day every every day yeah and uh, to talking about this the skyway how the skyway could save the planet this is actually all these uh, factors uh, that uh, that we that we that we can we can we can make it together yeah we can make it together because by the contribution of every person yeah so by reducing the co2 exhaust uh, co2 exhaust to the air yeah by reducing the amount of flights amount of flights uh, in the open air ship yeah? or in the open air because it's a uh, only only around uh, on the european territory it's only uh, about uh, 27000 flights uh, every day yeah so uh, the amount of uh, exhaust uh, exhausts that they are dropping uh, on all the countries yeah it's actually enormous so uh, and the the hole that they're making in, in layer uh, ozone is, uh, is uh, as the it's quite big yeah it could be like uh, maybe like great britain or like another small european country yeah so uh, <laughs> Uh, so this is uh, the way how we can save the planet by the, by our contribution in the other uh, Anatoly Dorashinitsky's project. So uh, and uh, we have uh, in Eco Techno Park uh, we're gonna show the four types of uh, of um, Skyway technologies. Yeah, of course if we talk about uh, uh, if we talk about the in uh, in the cities. Yeah, in the cities and the, the city skyway the passenger transport uh, for, uh, instead of buses uh, uh, subways uh, trams trolleys yeah and that is uh, diesel buses yeah can, 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 uh, driving on the regular diesel diesel engines so it's actually this is uh, city skyway is uh, could be up to 150 kilometers per hour yeah with the up to 40 passengers yeah on the second level no uh, no traffic jams yeah comfortable to go to the work comfortable to get to work from the work yeah and, <coughs> and the next one is uh for example the cargo the cargo transport yeah, is an automated autopilot uh, with the uh, with the heart uh, Technical, technical eyes, yeah, that is seen that up to five kilometers per hour. You can see even the match box, the match box on the rail, yeah, and uh, can uh, read the rails, what's going on with it, yeah. If so, of course we are for protected as well from the from the from any types of attacks. So uh, uh, the cargo is uh, actually a solution for a lot of countries and uh, such countries as Norway, yeah. Such countries as the Norway, yeah, there was the oil and gas industry, yeah, such as, uh, of course, such uh, our strategical partner in the Australia, yeah, and because of the charcoal, yeah. So uh, this is uh, how we can make the contribution in the saving our the planet. And uh, uh, one more, uh, one more uh, transport is in. Uh, regional, regional, regional skyway. Uh, regional skyway is a high high speed uh, 
high speed transport yeah up to 500 kilometers per hour and uh, up to high five with the capacity up to 100 uh, passengers so uh, this is actually the solution uh, uh, comparing to the, to the planes yeah so what we can take what we can take as a as a alternative uh, solution for the planes so i'm going to talk uh, um, to the details technical details of the construction of uh, uh, of the arrangement of the truck structure overground uh, yeah but, uh, so but but uh, the regional regional skyway is much much uh, better and safer ecological ecological better than the, the regular uh, planes for example yeah so uh, at least we can win and uh, on the co consumption so uh, by taking uh, by taking part in uh, the skyway project yeah each each person of us could be uh, not only just a shareholder and so invest and co-investor yeah but could become a, a helper and uh, could become helper and uh, become a part of the history yeah and in such way we can help and uh, mr anatoly darish unitsky uh, in this international project and uh, the, the further information I would like to ask uh, Mr. Armand uh, Murnex uh, uh, to, to join the conversation and uh, yeah, Armand hi yeah. do you hear me thank you yeah. thank you uh, I think there was uh, like a small mistake so we need to change the slides if you if you can please uh, check it uh, yeah to have the right slide yes and um, it was um, it was very good presentation uh, guys so I really would like to say big thanks to Boris because uh, he's uh, he's like one of us uh, he just uh, joined the company he's uh, starting to do the presentation so uh, he he told me that oh Armand you know what so sometimes I don't feel like uh, um, say I don't feel sure that I can do it but uh, Boris I can assure you so you did well and uh, keep going keep practicing and definitely it will be every day better and better so thank you very much and uh, uh, like uh, if you will check the slides and put the slides uh, which I have to uh, spoke about it will be amazing yeah okay dear friend tell me please do you hear me well uh, just uh, to check my microphone if you hear me well so i can i can keep going if not so uh, 10 10 okay cool uh i would like to ask you how many of you um understand so what what the boris were, were trying to to explain oh uh, boris can you bring the the previous slide please yes the previous slide yeah thanks uh okay so why, why I'm asking this? Because uh, like a, quite a lot of people, they don't understand actually what we are doing, why we are here. And uh, I would like to, um, I would like to ask you to answer the question to yourself. So, do you understand why you are here and uh, what what opportunities you have? In um, 19 uh 1987 so mr unitsky he was uh, he had the vision he had that idea how to build better uh better transport better future for our ourselves for our kids grand grand uh, grandkids and uh, uh i mean grand grandchildren and you know like so on uh to all the to pass the uh our planet to the next generation uh, better than we are uh, we have now i don't know how many of you are aware but today like uh, we are consuming 15 trillion watts of energy and uh, a lot of scientists already figured out that if we will keep doing that way or if we will be increasing so uh, only 20 years uh, will be left to live the same uh, lifestyle which we are living and why i'm actually uh, telling you all these uh, things because if we will look at uh, on um, like a, on a big picture right if we will look on that and uh, you will be able to see that all the big um, 
inventors like Elon Musk, uh, Anatoly Yunitsky, um, Richard Branson, um, what uh, what was that uh, that American mogul? Uh, Donald Trump. So all of them, they are uh, they are looking into the next uh, next technological uh, uh, structure, and this is uh, why why I'm so passionate to do this because let's uh, let's put it this way: How many of you today can join uh, to Elon Musk and help him to build Hyperloop? That is a the, the same principle. So what he's doing, he's uh, trying to implement the big uh, uh, i mean uh, implement quick uh, transport right to get from the point a to point b much more quicker than it's possible today uh, but no one's uh, not me not either you you can join and participate uh, that project why because there is a quite a lot of uh, big moguls so who is the financing anatoly unitsky he's a really generous man so he's uh, giving all of us chance to be part of it and um, i already told that many times but if we will um, if we will imagine just imagine that it's gonna happen yeah like a bitcoin so no one believed in in a bitcoin but uh, one day it just happened no one believed in uh, jack ma and his uh, alibaba uh, project but one day it happened the amazon it happened and uh, we just already um, we already lost those opportunities but we still can uh, reach for the next opportunities and uh, if we will uh, um, realize that everything what we are doing today one day it will change our life what do you think does it worth to try just think about it uh, I remember when I joined the company one and a half year ago, it was really tough, uh, tough moment. So there was a lot of rumors going on that the, uh, we were not going to build, we were not going to be able to to start uh, start the building process. We were not going to get any um, any support from the government. I can tell you this. So uh, I received positive answer from Ireland and uh, Irish government now. Uh, waiting uh, for this uh, to sign the first memorandum of uh, memorandum of agreement, and um, you know uh, these small things we did, all of us, all those two hundred fifty thousand people, they are participating every day, and they are uh, they they have first they change the minds because investor mind he's. Uh, mm, he can't be like, okay, I invested today and I will wait uh, until the next year or uh, year after that I, want, uh, I will get a lot of money. No. What, uh, let, let's, um, let's speak about investor. Who is investor? Investor is the guy uh, or the group of people who understands that they need to, let's say, um, let's imagine we are building shop. Yeah, we will be selling, uh, I don't know, whatever. Um, we are selling, let's say, plate okay let's say we are selling plates what do you think do we be able to sell plates until we will finish shop i don't think so do you think we will be able uh sell or uh, yeah even like a sell or pass it to someone shop until we will finish i don't think so uh natalie I really like that you are here. So guys, um, uh, as an investor, so we need to understand that today we need to take it from the point eight and take it to the last, uh, last stage of construction. And only after that, so we will get um, our reward. And today, uh, Boris, can you please change the slide? Because it's like uh, I have some some problems with slides. Guys, do you see slides or or you don't? Yeah, uh, leave this this one. Do you see slides? And uh, okay, cool. You see it. And uh, you see this is uh, on the left hand side. This is Anatoly Unitsky's. And uh, for 
uh, almost 40 years. So this guy, he's uh, never giving up. He's uh, doing whatever it takes to build his dream. And uh, this is something big, uh, bigger than uh, make money. This is something bigger than uh, to get uh, uh, to get uh, to be uh, like to become popular. Uh, this is something bigger than anything else in this world. What he is doing? So he is following his dream. And when you are following your dream, uh, it's like a, nothing can be better in life. And uh, Mr. Unitsky. He is not only following his dream, but he is also giving all of us the possibility to become a dreamer, to become uh, someone so who is uh, taking this his dream and uh, joining and making it happen. And all of us, we definitely know that we were going to build it. The question is, are you with us? Because um, uh, the uh, man on the right hand side, Elon Musk. I don't know how many of you know uh, know this. Uh, uh, this guy, but uh, Elon Musk, what he did in um, uh, the first project, so like his first successful project was PayPal. Imagine yourself, just imagine yourself, so that you are um, making a business, and then someone is coming and approaching you and saying, you know what, Tom, I'm happy to buy this business for 180 million, and you are selling. What will be your next steps? Just have to ask yourself, what will be your next steps? Are you going to spend the money to buy a nice luxury house, cars, um, brand clothes, uh, watches, and uh, all this kind of stuff? Probably, right? Because our, uh, our mindset is different. And this is a problem. And 99% uh, of people, so they are living uh, on a daily basis uh, with this mindset. But only uh, those people like uh, Elon Musk. So I, why, why I'm actually pointing on this guy? Because imagine, so he sold for 180 million his project. 100 million he invested in a SpaceX. And 80 million he invested in a Tesla Motors. How many of you heard about it? Press plus if you heard about it. Guys, please press plus. Okay, cool. So, yeah, okay, I get it. Uh, so, and uh, my point is that uh, imagine he has like a hundred percent of profit to himself, and then he's investing all that money. Imagine investing, he invested 100 million in a SpaceX and 80 million in a, in a Tesla motor. And uh, after uh, it, it recently happened, like uh, three months ago, he launched the SpaceX. And when he launched the SpaceX from NASA, straight away he get the deal for 102, uh, 1.4 billion. Just imagine he had 180 million, and he was absolutely fine. So he could live with that money for the rest of the life, right? But what he did. He invested and he started to do. Uh, he start to grow to the next level. And only people with the right mindset, with the mindset of the entrepreneur, they can do these things. No one else can. And uh, like, uh, I know that uh, English people they are saying, yeah, it should be like a, uh, you should have like a big balls to do that. But for us now, it's much more easier. All of us, we can be we can be the small piece of this uh, like uh, these two men. And all what we need to do, we just need to uh, we just need to look at the information. We just need to go through the information. We need to understand what we are uh, doing, why we are here, what is the uh, what is the main goal, what is the vision of Anatoly Unitsky. Okay, so I had a question about where the company is registered. Uh, Skyway Invest Group, that is the investment group. Uh, the company who is uh, uh, who has uh, agreement with Anatoly Unitsky that we will be providing funds to uh, be able to um, fund this construction. Uh, the construction, uh, Boris, if you will uh, change the slide, please. We already uh, have a construction in uh, Minsk, uh, it's uh, Belarus, uh, Marina Gorka. 
where we uh, have to build um, it will be like a eco techno park but uh, it's something like um, like a shop and you can see here so this is the project what we need to start what we need to build and it should be done until 2017 and you can see there is the first models uh, those models are 1 to 10 so that the measurement is 1 to 10 and they were already uh, like demonstrated and it's already uh, they already tried it and it works what does mean that mean that even all of us um, have some knowledge to build uh, something right so we need to try first on the model and if the model works so then you are making uh, like um, uh, measures a bit uh, uh, different yeah and then you have the transport i would like to point one thing uh, you see that um, that the unibus, which is uh, in the middle, hanging, right? Uh, maybe for us it's a toy, right? But imagine if we will take mice, or if we will take cat, or any other animal, and we will put it in, into the carriage. For for animal, it's already transport. And this is what Unitsky said. He said. Uh, when he showed this model, he said, all what we need to do, we just need to build uh, big big ones and uh, it will work the same way. And that means that there are no any more that big risk like it was at the start. And uh, all of us now, we are in the middle risk project. Of course, it's a still a risky project because uh, otherwise you will not going to get uh, the shares according to those prices. But uh, it's not anymore that risky like it was one and a half year ago where, uh, when we joined. Because at that time, it, uh, we didn't have the constructors, we didn't have land, we didn't have even uh, technical documentation done. But today we have. And today we are building. And it's like uh, it's the same when you are going, uh, going um, let's say, uh, to, to some place where, where the people building houses. And you can see that uh, they already like uh, put uh, put some concrete, or they are you know starting to build the house, and it's already take, uh, like uh, having the shape of uh, of house. And someone is approaching you and saying, you know what? So you can, uh, if you would like, you can be part, uh, you can be like a shareholder in this house, or you can maybe put the first deposit, and then uh, after they will uh, certify this house, you will be able to get it uh, for fifty percent of uh, of the price. Do you think it's a good deal? Of course, it's a good deal. So, uh, the company is registered in um, uh, Virgin Islands. And uh, wh why it's there? Because today, um, in a real, we are living in the real world. All of us, we are living in the real world. When you are working, you are paying taxes, right? So, uh, the same here. We are paying taxes. And when you are paying taxes and you can't generate the income, because we are, uh, all of us, me, you, everybody who is there, we are uh, today um, investors. We are financing this project. And uh, as an investor, I would like to know that all my money goes, uh, goes to the project, right? But there is a financial, um, uh, financial like a guard who are all the time, you know, trying to cut, cut some piece for them. But we are not making any revenue. How we can pay? But they don't care. They said if you are if if you are transferring money from uh, from one bank to another, you need to pay fee. If you are uh, withdrawing money from the banks, you need to pay tax, right? And uh, that's why uh, they decide to um, establish company in uh, tax-free zones. And this is only until the day when uh, when the company will be running. And this is, in, uh, it's not only about our company. There is a lot of companies and uh, you can check in uh, in uh, Wikipedia. It's um, the company called BlackRock. Uh, you know who is uh, like, uh, who is owning BlackRock? The owners of BlackRock, they are, uh, they are like a big guys, uh, like a Rothschild. Uh, um, uh, what was another one? Oh. Like American uh, big models, so they are owners of the company, and they also establish company in um, uh, in Virgin Island, and a lot of people are doing this. So there is a 
there is nothing to be ashamed that we are doing the same way because we are trying uh, to employ good solicitors who will lead us uh, to spend less money on the taxes, on the uh, fees, but to uh, get more money uh, bring to Unitsky to do this project. And uh, today, what I would like to point uh, that all of us, we need to uh, like a, uh, we need to take a commitment that we will be doing whatever it takes. But to do that, we need to know every day what's going on, what is uh, like uh, how the things are working, you know, with the from the third uh, parties like a government, right? Because um, today we have our uh, company and we have Unitsky. So both of them, they know that uh, the Skyway Invest Group can finance Unitsky and Unitsky can uh, build build those uh, roads, right? And uh, I'm pretty sure that uh, that both of them they can do. But the question is, who will give, who will allow us to do that? And that is a government. And today we have the first uh, um, first successful, uh, let's say, um, stories just just beginning. And there will be a day. So when you will see that a lot of people will be joining. A lot of people, even those people who uh, now you are talking uh, talking about this project with, and they don't believe, trust me, one day they will be approaching you and saying, you know, I'm so sorry that I didn't believe you, because now I believe, and I would like to be a part of it. And this, this is, you see on this slide, so we are we are already building. This is what, I, uh, what I've been uh, mentioning earlier about, uh, about the houses. We are building, and we need everybody's help. That's why don't be ashamed to tell uh, to tell to your friends to let's make it like a one big idea, like a national idea. Let's make uh, uh, all of our, all our um, neighbors to be involved, and we will be all the time going out, and we will be you know appreciating, uh, greeting them in the mornings, uh, evenings when we are coming back. So we will be like uh, in the same mood. And all what we need to do, we just need to we just need to spread the word. And for that, it's not for free. If you will do that, so you will get uh, after after he's signing, so you will get fifteen percent. And this is also it's nothing to be ashamed, because every even today in the Lloyd's Bank, if I'm bringing someone of you to the Lloyd's Bank and you are uh, you are opening account, I get five percent. I get 5% uh, out of my interest or 5% uh, uh, discount. And if I will bring two people, so it's a 10%. And it's absolutely normal. And today, all of us, we are, uh, we are selling something. Just look at yourself. You are dressing probably jeans, t-shirt or shirt. And it's, uh, it's some kind of brand. And when you are going out to see your friends, so you are selling this brand, but you don't get nothing. No one's no one's paying you for advertising, so that's why Andre and uh, our company we are uh, we are saying if you if you will be doing this, so we will be uh, we will be paying you the uh, the diff uh, not the different but percentage. And uh, every company, even Coca Cola, so today, so they're spending about from seventy to ninety percent on advertisement. All those nice advertisements in the TVs, the people are drinking Coke. But they are paying, paying a lot of money. Advertisement is a, uh, very expensive. But we are advertising. And here, uh, they, they choose the model when, when it's uh, like a mouth to mouth. You are going to, to your friends and just say, you know what? So they are building this here. So uh, you, you can be the part of it. Would you uh, do you mind to be part of it? Do you mind to invest some money, or you can you can save money because today it's like a very difficult situation uh, coming in, uh, to the euro and also in uh, in Russia and uh, everywhere. All the world is uh, like uh, up approaching big collapse, like it was in two thousand eight. Let's let's do something. I really, um, you know, um, I know that the technology. Uh, it will, it will be. There are no doubt about it. 
There will be the day when those universes will be running. But the question is, are you in or you are out? So, um, I have some questions. Okay, guys, you can uh, you can uh, write the questions now, and uh, let me let me see. Uh -huh. Is the possibility to uh, what email do uh, so is the possi um, is there a possibility to send an email if we have recorded link? What would help to members? Uh, what do you mean? Uh, Dilishwar, what do you mind about it? So, um, I may be a silly question, but I just want to clear on my perspective. Uh, the main head office is located in um, British Virgin Island, and uh, all the uh, constructors are located in uh, Minsk, Belarus. Uh, recognized in USA and Europe. Uh, the company. What uh, what do you mean by recognize? So uh, the, uh, a lot of uh, a lot of countries and big uh, mm, big guys knows about us. And uh, Unitsky he was approaching all of them during those thirty seven years. Uh, past fifteen years, uh, um, there was another Sergey Sibirik also who joined uh, who joined this. Uh, journey uh, with Unitsky and uh, he was doing the same. Uh, a lot of people know about us, but uh, we need to certify to be able to sell it all over the world. A UK government uh, now um, having more and more um, questions about this project and they are more and more open uh, to start you know, discuss a uh, couple ways how to implement it here in in London particularly and also in Ireland. So great, two minutes. We are for future webinars. Can we use the? They are recorded as the time difference. So investors from all over the world. Uh, yes, guys. Um, Jen, um, definitely we are recording all our webinars. Um, I will send you, I already sent you, but I will send you one more time. So this is our YouTube channel where you are more than welcome to, um, uh, to subscribe. There are not only these webinars, so we were doing webinars before, but today we need to run more and more webinars. And I would like to ask all of you, like if you like this project, if you see uh, potential of it, if you if you can um, imagine how great future it will be, because all of us we are um, we are responsible what we're gonna leave after we will uh, leave this uh, earth. And it's not only, you know, um, I don't have a kids yet, to be honest, I don't have uh, yet. <laughs> I'm planning to have, but uh, not yet. But um, I was asking my mom, you know, like uh, those advertisements where they are so, uh, showing uh, African kids who are um, desperating of uh, water and uh, food. And then uh, like uh, I was sitting with my mom and I asked, mom, what, what are you going to do if I will be there? And, you know, I was shocked. The answer what she she gave me, she said, I will sell everything what I have to get you out of there. And I realized that when I will have a kid, I will be probably thinking the same way. And maybe it's a uh, time to start it right now. Maybe it's a start a time to start right now to understand in where we are living and how we are living. Because this is probably important. Okay, what will happen with the building of main and people after certification process when the shares will be sold? Very good question, uh, Mr. Solar. Just a second. So, um, why, why it's a good question? Because a lot of people think that we are doing uh, mouth level marketing business. Uh, multiple marketing businesses uh, such as Amway, Herbalife, uh, uh, Vision, uh, 
or what else? Uh, there's like a, a lot of a lot of um, companies, right? Uh, what are they doing? They are selling product. They are selling product every day, month, year, decade, and uh, until you are selling product. So basically, you need to have uh, you are making the chain of your people, and then you are feeding those people with the with the product. Uh, this is uh, a, a bit different. We are using a uh, multi-level marketing system. We are using this uh, uh, marketing strategy only to be able to raise the funds which is necessary for uh, building this uh, eco-techno park. After that, all our shareholders will be financially free. Why? Uh, of course, it depends how much you are investing. But if you are investing today um, about uh, $500, so then you have, uh, I think, more or less about 100,000 shares. In 2017, according the um, according the nominal uh, share price, it will be uh, $100,000. And uh, just calculate. Just don't uh, don't uh, just uh, listen, but uh, do the calculation. If you will calculate today uh, how much you are earning and uh, how much you will uh, be left with in 2017, even if you are not participating today, you will see that uh, only a couple thousand maximum you will be saved. Because there will be a lot of expenses, there will be a lot of uh, travelings. Uh, then uh, probably someone, the police, catch catch you on uh, over speeding or like a, you will lose the money anyway. Because sometimes we are uh, even for those people who who like to have you know a couple um, a couple drinks after work or uh, the fr Friday evening. So we are losing so much money. So why then not to put in uh, something good? Why not to be part of something good? And uh, with each of uh, with each investment, you are helping not only yourself, but m m mainly you are helping uh, Mr. Yunitsky to uh, finish his dream and uh, to leave something behind you. And uh, answering your question, so the multi-level marketing strategy which we are using, it will be only until we will. Uh, capitalized and uh, this shouldn't be 2017 according to marketing right it could be tomorrow it could be after a week because today all those shares there's only 20 percent of shares who uh, who mr unitsky is happy to give away in uh, in exchange to the money which is necessary to uh, like uh, fund the project to finance the project that's it after that there will be target projects, but in the target projects won't be any more that good opportunity to invest because uh, today we are investing in venture. The venture investments, that is the most profitable investments. If you will uh, write it down and if you will go to the Google, uh, I mean, um, ask Google or uh, uh, Wikipedia, yeah, so you will see the venture capitals. They are the most profitable, but in the same time, they are very risky. Uh, inflation is a big also inflation yeah uh, also yeah a lot of people are losing money because of inflation you know I did it myself so uh, everything what I'm what I'm uh, sharing here I experienced by myself I uh, kept uh, in a Lloyds bank that is a British bank I kept there a uh, couple thousand pounds and it was under the six percent a year and then uh, I came after two years and I was expecting because I was calculating six and six. So it will be uh, like uh, uh, on top of my couple thousand will be six and then uh, like uh, uh, two thousand plus those six percent. So it will be about like a five hundred. I should earn more. And you know what was uh, what how I surprised was when I went there and I said, you know, I would like to take out my money. And they gave me only one hundred and twenty six uh, pounds uh, on the top of that. And I said, actually, it should be about like a 400 something. And they said, oh, no, because we had inflation 2.4% in the previous year. And this year we are doing better and we have only 1.2. But that means that you are off uh, like a 4%. And they gave me only like a 2, two, and two point something more. And this is a real thing. 
It's a, it's a no point to keep uh, all the money in a bank. It's a no point to keep all the money in other, uh, other um, uh, companies. Because you should uh, know that today you are paying probably for, for your pension scheme, right? But that pension, uh, I don't know. Like if today I'm paying for my pension, so uh, it's after 30 years. What's going to happen after 30 years? Maybe there will be World War Three, and I will never get the money back. So I hope uh, I hope I answer. There will be the targeted projects. There will be the small projects, and uh, all of us will be involved because all of us we will be uh, f uh, mainly. Why? Why I also um, would like to point on this: we are financing b very big, massive project. This this project uh, will um, uh, have a market much more than today uh, have Apple, Google, and uh, Microsoft together. Because we are talking about infrastructure, we are talking about resources. In the Russian itself, it's a 97% of land which are uh, not uncovered. Uh, I mean, discovered. There is a lot of resources. But the problem is they don't have a transport to get there. And uh, with this transport, so we have this possibility. Of course, some people will say, oh, it's a Russia, so how do I know that I will be safe? You don't need to be known. Because uh, the company is uh, in the British Virgin Islands, so this is a and this is an offshore company, so there won't be a possibility for the Russian government to uh, to uh, get there and do something bad, or maybe for someone else. So I hope uh, I hope I answer all these uh, questions. Um, what I would like to what I would like to uh, say at the end, I'm really happy that uh, all of you are here and uh, we were uh, you were there for the whole hour. I hope that you enjoyed it, and uh, I really hope that uh, that important message what I would uh, what I was trying to deliver, I did. And uh, I just uh, started the new training session with Andre and uh, Victor. And you know what, uh, on the first lesson I realized that uh, a lot of us, we are focusing on our loses. A lot of us, uh, we are um, like, we are remembering those, uh, those days when we were down, when we were pushed by, uh, I don't know, maybe friends or maybe it was um, by our employer. But uh, you know what? We need to turn them and put it as a uh, wind. Because when you are overcoming your losses, you are becoming a winner and you are getting to the next step. You are getting to the next stage. And every day, if you will be better than yesterday, so guys, you have a great future. Uh, I'm really glad that... Uh, so there is another... It went better. Yeah, and also uh, Boris uh, Boris didn't uh, didn't mention that um, uh, last uh, last time we we were running also a webinar and uh, of course uh, I did webinars for 600 people and sometimes when I have like a 20 30 people only uh, participating you know it's it's uh, the feeling is really sad it's bad and I think oh what shall I do you know to to improve it but um, I remember how my mentor said, he said, even if there is the one person who came first time, you need to do 100%. You need to do it better than you did last time. Why? Uh, and there's the answer. So uh, Boris, uh, basically, after our previous um, uh, webinar, uh, when we finished uh, that webinar, uh, he was approached by the lady uh, who contacted him Maybe Boris, you will uh, you will tell it because I know it from from your word. So I just I just would like to share yes. information. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Thank you, Armand. Uh, yes, it was actually really interesting. It is a really interesting story that happened uh, uh, with us after uh, the first webinar. Two days two days later, I was uh, contacted by one. Uh, one of the ladies from the Oslo, uh, from the Oslo city. Uh, she is a, a quite well-known person, a, a business lady, I would like to say. Yeah, and uh, she offered me a meeting 
and to talk a little bit about uh, the opportunities of, of Skyway development of, of the Skyway project development in the uh, in the Norway and about its cities. So uh, I came uh, after two days later. It was the, the previous week, and uh, we get to know each other. So uh, we had a talk about three, four hours uh, about the. Scandinavian and, and the European market, and uh, she's doing the business in, the, in Norway for 20 years already. So, uh, and uh, actually, we agreed to collaborate in the uh, Skyway uh, technology, promoting it here in the Scandinavia. And uh, what was my? Uh, I was so so surprised when uh, two days later. Uh, I get uh, I get a call uh, from the council minister of uh, Kazakhstan in Norway. Yes, uh, and uh, she was uh, very interested in the Skyway project uh, here and uh, offered uh, a meeting. So uh, actually, two days uh, two days back on this this Friday, the fifth of uh, September, fifth of February, uh, I was uh, visiting the embassy of Kazakhstan in Norway, and uh, talking about uh, making the presentation of uh, our uh, technology, and yeah, talking about the construction bureau, and uh, we have achieved. Uh, Achieved some uh, deals, yeah, uh, deals, uh, but uh, haven't signed any uh, collaborational uh, contracts at the moment. But uh, I would like to say that uh, uh, and the thing, uh, the thing we are moving and uh, we are doing here uh, is working. And uh, by already, already by the council minister of the of the Kazakhstan here, uh, I was presented to uh, one of the biggest uh, transport person uh, in Norway and uh, we, 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 I talked to him uh, by the telephone and uh, we agreed that uh, we will take one more uh, phone talk on the 15th of February and we'll organize uh, a meeting in the Oslo probably it will be already the meeting altogether with the construction bureau uh, from uh, with the representatives of uh, Skyway Technologies from the Minsk so it will be like three part uh, uh, but uh, we will see. Uh, at the, at, as it uh, at the moment, uh, as it uh, uh, not not hundred uh, percent sure, but uh, <laughs> that I will. I, I, I don't want to open all the cards uh, before the thing has happened. Yes, uh, <laughs> this okay, is. Okay, Boris. Th uh, th thank you, Armand. Thank you. Uh, okay, guys. Um, uh, uh, I would like to hear a bit from you. Uh, I saw that there was uh, questions, the people were asking questions, so that, uh, thank you very much that you are participating. Uh, please uh, give us uh, your feedback. So did you get anything new today? Did you, uh, did you are uh, like uh, satisfied or you're disappointed? What you would like, uh, what you would like to hear on the next webinars? Because I would like to also to apologize for all those people who, who has to uh, listen uh, first 20 minutes just about the technology, about Unitsky, about all this stuff, which probably you already know, but uh, we need to focus uh, guys on the people who are coming the first time, who are coming second time, who has like uh, uh, maybe Mm, you know, uh, the other people saying, oh, it's a silly question, so just go and read yourself. There are no silly questions. All the questions you were asking uh, when you came and joined first time, I was asking the same questions, and uh, there are people who are, you know, going the same path. And you don't know who uh, who this person will be in the future. So I would like to uh, hear from you if you are... Uh, if you are satisfied or if you are not satisfied, just uh, give your feedback. So just uh, write in the chat from the uh, from the one to ten how uh, how good you found this webinar. Um, also, I would like to finish this webinar with um, because there are no uh, a lot of uh, new people. Thank you, thank you, Jim. 
we give us the promo codes. Yes, I will give you promo codes today. Mm. So just a second. No. Okay. We are giving the promo codes. Like, uh, uh, let me explain you why you need promo codes. If you are uh, first time uh, came to the webinar and you would like to uh, sign up and you would like to know more about the project and you would like to participate uh, or uh, you know someone who who probably will be interested. Uh, also, I would like to say that there, uh, this company it's absolutely new and there will be a lot of job opportunities even for those people who are not you know, who are not uh, like investors or they don't have any um, knowledge how to approach people, how to spread the world. So there will be a lot of possibilities for you as well because the company will be expanding every day and day and we need new and new uh, members, staff members. We need uh, to have uh, probably in a call center people and there will be a lot of job opportunities for all of us. Um, Okay, the promo code will be uh, okay. So the first, uh, first are for if you are buying uh, any of uh, packages, uh, or uh, and the last one, the it will be for the hundred shares. Basically, uh, our company is giving all of us the possibility only for registration only for joining this uh, project you are getting straight away small amount of shares and that is only for um, like uh, keeping us together and uniting us with the one idea uh, I really um, glad that all of you are still here um, I really glad Boris uh, that you were joining and you did better than yes uh, than last time and i know that you just practice and you will be absolutely fine for the rest of you guys thank you very much for uh, for coming uh the next webinar we will have on tuesday it will be for our um partners and uh, every time we are bringing the uh, like a new people uh we are trying to expand because if everybody like we have uh, like uh, already 26 people if all of us will uh, bring at least one person just uh, just say you know what uh, just join join the webinar listen if you if you will like it so i will tell you more about it if you don't so I will, it's absolutely fine and uh, i will not going to bother you anymore uh most of those people will tell you, okay, you know, I don't like it maybe now, but uh, when you are asking him, okay, but do you mind if I will give you uh, updates all the time about the project, how we are doing, uh, uh, what news are coming and things like that. So the people will never uh, refuse it and they will be uh, listening and you will be sending the links because there's a lot of things happening today in uh, Eco Techno Park with Anatoly Unitsky and there will be more and more coming. Thank you very much uh, for your time. Um, there is a thank you. As as of today, how many countries already interested and accepting this project? Uh, at the moment, uh, um, we have quite a lot of countries. Uh, basically, Unitsky has quite a lot of countries. But uh, personally, I know uh, two countries who is uh, now. Uh, more and more showing interest uh, about this project. May two sections to. You mean uh, 22 beginners? Uh, it's um, 10, uh, 10 and 9. Thank you so much. Promo codes. Uh, is the webinar going to be? Uh, every Sunday, yes, at nine o'clock. But we we are also we will try to adapt um, uh, to 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 other countries. Uh, but uh, at the moment, yes. So we are figuring out that it will be uh, Tuesdays nine o'clock. Maybe we will do at at eight uh, or uh, maybe early. And uh, Sunday it will be nine o'clock in the evening. Maybe also we will do it a bit earlier. Um, and maybe we will change one of the day, but uh, at the moment it will be like that. It's 98 countries are interested in technology. Not 98. At the moment we have 32 countries. Mm, 
a little bit, no, a little bit more than territories. I think already 35 countries uh, where we have our investors, where we have our people, where we have representatives, and they are expanding every day. That's why we need all of you to um, to come and help. Okay, guys, thank you very much and have a good night. And just remember one thing: if you born poor, it's not your fault. But if you will die poor, it's definitely your fault. Thank you. Have a good night.